Hello, brothers and sisters of the light. I am Julie Joy of the Young Light Workers with another amazing message for all of you from the 12D Creators, a non physical collective consciousness, as channeled by Daniel Scranton for January 25th, 2024. And the title of this message is What is Your Purpose and How Do You Find It? We are here for you. We are the creators. We are a 12th dimensional collective of non-physical beings and we are here to help. We are always interested in helping you to seek out that which will fulfill your life's purpose. We are here to remind you at times that you are creating this life. Now that you are awake, you do not have to live out some preordained purpose for your life but rather you get to determine what that purpose is and then move towards the fulfillment of what purpose you choose to have for your life. Now, looking at life in a very human way, you would think that you only have so many years to get it all done in. But looking at your life from the picture of the eternal and infinite self that you truly are, you realize you have all the time in the world and in the universe. In fact, you realize that nothing actually has to get done, but you also recognize that you are there and you might as well have some experiences. You might as well do more work than just run out the clock until your time is up in this lifetime. And so the question then comes into play, is it nature or is it nurture? In other words, do you feel drawn to certain activities, certain experiences, and certain people because it was preordained that you would move in those directions? Or are some of your proclivities developed through the time you are there and the experiences that you have while you are there? Both can play a part, of course. Some of you have come in with certain gifts and certain interests, and then you wonder what you were supposed to do with those gifts or how to monetize those interests, and it is important for you to consider these things. But it is always most important for you to just pursue them and pursue them with reckless abandon. When you access more of your inner child and, and you take play more seriously, you recognize that as a child you would create without limitation. You would create without giving a second thought to what you were creating or what you would do with it. And that is the way to pursue your interest in this lifetime and create for yourselves a fulfillment of your life's purpose. Now, when you are denying something that is inside of you and you continue to deny its existence, then yes, you may get a wake-up call. And in that wake-up call, you may be told that you are not fulfilling your mission in life. We know that many people have those experiences, but it does not mean they are only supposed to do those things because an outside force thinks they are. When someone has an impulse to do something and they don't follow through with it, then they are denying themselves their truest expression of self, and that is something that they need to change in order to make perfect use of the lifetime. So you see the purpose. The mission was not preordained and you are not there to discover what it is by looking under every rock for it, but rather you are there to determine for yourselves what your mission is and listen to the guidance that's coming to you from within and nudging you towards it in every waking moment. And then you fulfill that mission, that purpose. You may feel a sense of satisfaction and then move on to another one. So you see, it's not even that you only have one purpose in your life, just like you don't have just one life. Very good. We are the creators, and we love you so much. This was an amazing message, and I'm sure it's applicable to many of you who are listening here with us today. This message was channeled by Daniel Scranton. His own website is danielscranton.com. Please stop by there and see everything that Daniel has to offer. Also, his YouTube channel is simply his name, Daniel Scranton, where you can actually watch him channeling the 12D creators. I will be able to post the words to this message below in the show more section. I am Julie Joy, your servant to the light, and it's always with much honor and deep gratitude I'm able to bring these amazing messages to all of you. Thank you so much for listening. Mm -hmm.